following video is guaranteed to be terrible. What is wrong with you? Welcome to another video by me. Uh, I am going to make a bit of a, an odd video today. Sorry about the thumping and the banging and probably bad audio. I'm using one, two of my older cameras here. I've got this camera here. I can see myself in the monitor right there and I will try not to look at it. I also have another camera down here which is going to do all the close-ups of what I'm doing with my hands because I know you want to see what I'm doing with my hands. This is going to be a bit of a disgusting video because I am going to show you this. I've uh, I bought one of these. I've seen, I, I don't know if you've seen the adverts where you live. But this is kind of like, uh, I'm being advertised here currently, it is a shawl velvet smooth with diamond crystals, express peddy, it doesn't say. Go down to the other camera, I'll show you. Seriously, it does not say what it is on there. Can you see that? I can't, I can't see, it doesn't actually, it doesn't say what it is. People are going to pick this up. And they're going to look at it and go, what is that? I know I would see this on the shelf and I would see it. I'd see it some sort of rotating diamond uh, abrasive cylinder. And I'd think, oh, that's useful. I could slowly erase the eyebrows from small children. But no, this is actually for removing the hard stuff at the, on the heel of your feet. Now, you might say I don't have hard stuff on the heel of my feet. And you would be a big, probably fat, liar. I know I am. Here's the science. Growing skin on our feet so that it became this hard, soul-like, horrible, skinny material on the base of our feet, which we now see as disgusting, enabled us to stop cutting our feet on glass and knives and, and big, sharp spikes that people used to walk around on all the time in olden days. But in the modern days of socks and shoes, our feet tend to be beautiful and soft, and uh, I guess it's part of the evolutionary process that our feet only go a little bit hard every now and then when we've had a pretty tough day Day walking around and that's why we need something like this this is essential in everyday life well anyway I thought I'd buy one and I have bought one and I'm gonna try it right now I have my knife this is my uh, leather man charge you can cut to the other camera cut to the other camera look at this how safely I am being as I cut around I'm not even attempting to open it at the sides as it seems to want me to there's a cat there can you see the cat's always fascinated don't worry I will be careful to not let the cat die. Don't die, cat. Okay, he's not too happy. And pull this back. And I'm going to give you my I'm going to give you my first impressions of this as I as I pull it out of the box. My first impressions are this is a cheap piece of garbage. This cost me about um, maybe 25 quid. Uh, I don't know. I can't remember. Uh, I think it's actually more expensive than that. Ooh, you, ooh, look at this. Sorry, I should be showing this to the camera what I'm doing here. So I've just opened up the base, uh, and all these batteries have attempted to fall out. There's some weird piece of plastic. Let's put this down. There's some weird bit of plastic in here. Look. Huh? I suppose that that was just there to stop the batteries connecting. So that's now gone. This ring also exists. So I'll pop that back. I guess. Should I pop that back, or is that? And oh, no, I'll get rid of that. Do I need that? I don't think I do. Oh my lordy, how do I... Okay, so I'm now popping this back on and I'm screwing. It's left a gap there. And if I turn this... Oh! you see that? See, it's diamond encrusted. Now, the Leatherman, for example, has diamonds as well in its file. So I'll show you, which you can see is all dirty and being used on my nails. Uh, and it's actually brilliant. It does not lose its uh, abrasiveness. Um, now, in theory, this would be the same because these are supposed to be lots of little million bits of bits of diamonds, which makes you think not likely this only cost £24. But um, my thoughts are that this is not little bits of diamonds. This are little bits of other stuff. Uh, it says diamond crystals, so they could be crystals in the shapes of diamonds. Uh, I doubt that it's actually diamonds, otherwise this would be costing a hell of a lot more than £25. Um, also, you can get replacements for that little, you can get replacements for this little barrel, uh, which is kind of, sort of defeats the object, I think. You know, if, if, what, ooh, if you press this in here, look, and the barrel pops out. It feels very cheaply made. Let me just pop that back in. I think I've already broken it. What am I doing? 
Okay, oh, hold on. Excuse my shaky hands. You know I got shaky hands, don't you? Don't you, ladies and gentlemen? Don't you, ladies? Some of you might say, you know, if you got shaky hands, why, why, why are you operating cameras? And the, the truth is that uh, I, I don't always have shaky hands. I have shaky hands when I have lots of coffee, and I'm also nervous around you because you're scary as hell. So here it is. Um, now, this is where you should turn away because I'm going to show you the sole of my foot. It might be disgusting. It might. I'm just warning you. I'm just saying. Are you ready? This is this is going to be particularly disgusting because I have a black tabletop here. Uh, and while I do this, all the little bits of skin are going to fall onto the tabletop. It is actually going to be repulsive. I, I wouldn't watch this video if I were you. I seriously wouldn't. Uh, because my feet are pretty cracked. That's why I bought this damn thing. Because they're sore. They get cracked. It's got, I, I don't care what you're going to say, it's got nothing to do with hygiene. It's got nothing to do with lifestyle. It's got everything to do with the fact my feet are cracked. I'm a human being! I'm not an elephant! Okay, then here we go. There you go. Is that disgusting? So, let me just pick away at this so you can see how cracked my skin is. It's really bad, isn't it? I can tap it. Look, it's tapping. It's making a tapping noise. That's just how bad things are. Things have got pretty bad. I now have this thing here. I now have this. And, and things won't be so bad here in Fluctibus Towers because I have this. The Flucty Shave. So let's see how we go. Let's, let's, let's switch it on. Bring it down to here. You ready? This is quite exciting. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, baby. You see? See, that, that's a lot more smooth and not quite as disgusting to look at. This is pretty disgusting though, isn't it? Yeah, it's disgusting. Okay, you can watch again. You can watch. That was really quite repulsive, wasn't it? I'm sorry. I know I disgust you. I disgust lots of people. Uh, but this is it. So, my thoughts about this. Okay, well, I'm going to try this on my other foot now. Uh, I'm not going to show you that. But I'll get back to you let you know how I get on. Right, other foot has been done. Uh, the right foot has now been done, which was in a little bit of worse state, I have to say. Now the thing is, you have to wait until your feet are really dry and the skin's really dry in order to use this. Go and have a shower and a bath and come out. Your, your skin will be all be soft and this will be pretty ineffectual. And I've had some thoughts about it. I definitely think that this is losing its abrasiveness pretty quick already, after only a few minutes of use. Uh, I also noticed that when you use it, the uh, it kicks up like a dust, which you wouldn't get normally if you're just using one of those like uh, shoehorn type um, uh, sanders, you know, the ones you use by your hand where you actually have to put some effort in. Uh, so this really is for lazy people. I mean, it, 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 you just sit there like, blah, blah, blah. but what it does, it kicks up like a fine dust. So initially I started, s <laughs> this is disgusting, but I started smelling the skin. It's kind of weird. And then I could feel myself, it was all floating in my, it, it was like, the, the, the dust particles are so fine, it kind of floats, it kicks them up into the air and you start breathing in this dead skin, which is you know, horrible. I mean, that's horrible, isn't it? So uh, that this does that, or it certainly did it with me. Um, would I, am I happy I bought it? I don't know, I don't think I am. I don't think I would pay uh, to the 25 quid I, I paid for this. One, because I feel like I've been a little bit misled by this uh, Diamond Crystals line. I don't think there's any diamonds in this at all, come to think of it, really. I just think there's crystals on it, in it. The shape of diamonds, perhaps. I have no idea. Um, the other thing is that the build quality isn't very good. It's really messy. I don't like that I'm suddenly breathing in dead skin off my feet. And frankly, um, it's, it's ooh factor is enormous. And look how dusty it is. I mean, I'm just, it's just everywhere, this stuff now. It's just settling all over me, all over my clothes, all over the, the cats are breathing in my dead feet. What the hell? I can actually see this as actually being quite dangerous. Well, not dangerous, but 
if you don't monitor what you're doing with it, you can actually go down too far, I imagine, and, and, and get rid of so much skin they actually go through to some sensitive material and you start hitting the nerves and uh, and that's not nice. The mess is horrible so obviously you're supposed to put a towel down when you do this. I wanted to do this just to make as disgusting a video as I possibly could and I think you'll agree I've achieved that. I, I'm quite impressed with the, the design of it. It's, kind, it's, it's It doesn't feel too bad. I mean it's plasticky. It's, it's not fantastically well built. Um, this cylinder does bother me. This is going to wear down real quick. It seems a bit unfair really that uh, the cylinder would wear down so 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 quickly I I don't like that they put the word diamonds uh, crystals onto the box because that makes you think it's going to last forever and it's just not true uh, and it's all a bit of a like you know there's you know if they're going to start the relationship the relationship between me and them trusting the product that they sold me uh, that way by like trying to give me the illusion and I suspect I think that's what they're trying to do then. Um, that the illusion being that this is like gonna last forever it's diamonds you know diamonds we all know cut th only diamonds can cut diamonds for example the hardest stone that we're aware of I think no doubt you can correct me but I'm already seeing that the the the, um, the cylinder here is starting to get a little bit flattened off it doesn't feel as abrasive as at the edges um, it's uh, yeah, it's okay though, you know, I'm quite happy with it. I think I'm going to continue on and do uh, all the other little bits of hard skin I have. I've got hard skin at the soles of my feet, just on the heels really. I've also got some hard skin just at the back of my neck and uh, just, just underneath my arms. A little bit underneath uh, the, my left uh, moob. Uh, I've also got a little bit of hard skin, skin um, down in my, um, just at the end of my, uh, my, um, so I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, then you know what to do. If you don't want to do it, you don't have to. You don't have to do anything. It's up to you. But I hope you found that entertaining, at least, if, it, if not factually um, <laughs> useful. Uh, it was a demonstration of how to use this little device. Uh, I feel almost bad. I'm a little bit embarrassed to show you what I just showed you. But, uh, you know, the things I do for you, and I do them because I love you, it is I do love you. I, I do. Uh, I think uh, the ladies out there I particularly love. I, I find out where you live and I come around and I watch you. Yeah. I do do that. No, I do. What woman? What lady? What lady doesn't want a guy with beautiful, soft, beautiful, 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 sandy down skin? I know if I was a woman and wanted to, a straight woman wanted to meet a straight guy, I would want them pretty sandblasted to f**kery. Now that, well that really is it. If you want to uh, chat with me, you can. I am at Fluctibus Flood on uh, Tinternet, on Twitter. Uh, you can just leave a comment down below. I'm pretty good. Uh, I've got so few followers, only a, only a handful, 72 at the last count. And so I do chat with you if you've got any questions about stuff like this. And uh, always happy to. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope I see you again. And in, uh, uh, yeah. Go and check out my vlogging channel, by the way. I've got a little vlogging channel where I, I trek my way through my life as a TV producer. I know. It's, yes. I, I mean, I know. I know. Well, I, I know. Goodbye.